Mungkin dia berongnya bambang asli Apa? feels good of course to be back uh, to represent the country once again and uh, of course uh, we each and every time the call ups come we want to be there to help the team but uh, unfortunately the last two fixtures I couldn't make it because of an injury but uh, gladly now the progress is quite good and uh, I'm back in action so it feels good to be back well, uh, uh, every coach, you know, he wants to have his best players, you know, and uh, his key players in the squad. And uh, it's good to see that uh, most of our players have uh, recovered. Uh, those with issues, you know, uh, have, have also recovered and now they are back uh, in their feet. And uh, it's been a long time since we had our full squad and I believe now uh, we, are, we are close to complete, you know, but uh, still... Uh, uh, there's room for improvement, but uh, all the players you know are capable. You saw in the first two games we had a lot of players who didn't play before they came into the squad and they delivered. So this is what now we say that we, now we have a strong team that can compete. We know the task ahead. Uh, Cameroon, you know, one of the favourites in the group. They are a strong opponent. Everybody knows their history with football. Uh, but also us, we, we, we have four points similar to them. So it's, it's, it's a game of six points to play for. Uh, we are determined, you know, going to start away. Uh, all the boys are psyched and prepared, and we believe that we are going to get something positive. Well, of course, uh, it was a difficult period for me, you know, because I started the league quite well, and then after uh, got sidelined uh, with a thigh injury. But now I'm back in uh, a full fitness, you know, and uh, it gives me confidence to see the last two fixtures, you know, scoring back to back. I hope I can still compete in the same level in the national team. And uh, the most important thing is, you know, try just to uh, bring the unity in the team so that uh, as we are going to approach these two fixtures, which is very crucial, uh, is also to urge uh, for support from Kenyans because uh, uh, after the first game against Zimbabwe, there was a lot of negative talk. But after we went and got something positive uh, against Namibia, uh, everybody started believing. So it's a two-legged fixture, you know, we, 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 we recall also the support from Kenyans. They need to be patient with the team. They need to realize that, uh, of course, this kind of high caliber fixtures, we need to go out there and compete and show also Kenyans the, the hard work that the team has been building for the last uh, one year. So uh, we just want to thank uh, everybody who supports us, you know, through thick and thin. And uh, we, as the, uh, as the playing unit, we are going to give 100% uh, so that we can uh, get uh, positive results. I'm looking forward to hopefully playing a big part in the in the team and helping the team to get results. I feel like in these games it comes down to whether we blend with each other and it comes down to a team as it's a team sport and I feel like the group is very together and it's a, it's a good environment so hopefully we take that into the game and come out with a positive result. So we know how hard it will be but I think we are on a level where I think only the details will decide. I don't believe that uh, it will be easy for Cameroon, even if they have no missing player, nothing. So, but this time I'm happy that we have only a few players missing because before we had, I don't know what happened, how many players was always missing. So this is one of the problems we have uh, in, in our way to grow is that I have nearly never the possibility to play with the same team, you know. And they have to, uh, if you have uh, really some structures where every player knows blind what to do, then they have to need more time together. And this we didn't have. Plus also, uh, still everybody is forgetting this, that we never play at home for a very long time, which is physically and also mentally very uh, uh, hard for us. So therefore, for me, these two matches against Cameroon is, uh, will be also a signal uh, on the way if we go for AFCON, if we are, for example, in knockout stage, what we can do. So therefore, I think uh, we will be ready. Uh, the boys looks good, even if it will be today the first training we will do all together because even this morning some players came so therefore I, I'm very hopeful. 